Bye, guys. I hope it's not too close up. Actually, exhausted, but I just wanted to really talk about my rice water experience real quick. I just want to say that I finished using rice water and I really don't think anything happened. I used it for six days instead of seven days. First of all, people who use it on YouTube claim in majority of the videos that it works magic overnight that they magically grow inches of hair overnight and that was the target of my video that was what i was really trying to discover when i started doing this rice water for this brief period i have seen videos where they say it worked magic in two hours or two days it worked magic in three days it worked magic in seven days and guys, I used it for six days, which was almost seven days. And I used it the same way these people did it. I used it consistently every single day for those six days in the morning and in the night. Apart from the protein overload and the fact that it actually helped with detangling my hair, I didn't see any difference. I don't want to say it's because I did one or two things that the people didn't do in their own videos. But I just want to say I don't think it's such a magical hair growth formula. I think it's just rice water and I think it's just one of the things that when incorporated into hair care regimens for a long period of time you tend to see the results that come from incorporating good things into your regimen over long periods of time. So in my own case I used rice water like I said every day for those six days and what I did was I put my hair into chunky twist the first day I applied the rice water in sections and then the next day when I reapplied my rice water I had to seal with oil because it was actually really dry. Another thing about rice water is that it dries our hair so my hair was actually too dry for me. It was really really dry and I had to seal with an oil so I just used olive oil sealed my hair and then I applied my rice water for the rest of the week or, or for the rest of the period. Now after I sealed my hair that day, I simply put my hair into that thing that you saw when I washed my hair. I'm going to show you guys in a video where I washed my hair, I simply matted my hair all the way to the back in two chunky sections and then that was that. So I left my hair that way for the rest of the six days which made it me leaving my hair that way for four days and that was that i just kept reapplying the rice water to my hair making sure my scalp was saturated and then i didn't seal with oil anymore after that from my own experience i think most people exaggerate when they say that that rice water works magic because first of all a lot of people whom i've seen use rice water already have long hair once your natural hair is long long unless you're able to mark where your hair was before you started and where your hair was after the magical growth you get from using rice water for such a brief period we really can't see growth guys and what most people will tell you is that your hair is already long we can't see growth so people with shorter hair should go ahead and use this rice water and see whether they'll get the same amount of growth that the people with long hair claim to get and that is one of the reasons i also did it because i have short hair my hair is not quite as long as most people who've used rice water so that was one of the reasons why i decided to try this in all honesty without extras and see if my hair would grow as speedily as youtubers claim their hair grows I'm not calling anyone out. I'm not saying anyone was lying. Maybe your hair growth rate is different from mine, which is actually most definitely true. And also maybe your hair is more embracing of rice water than mine is. Also, maybe your hair tends to grow faster with things like rice water than mine does. And also maybe my hair just didn't want to grow with the rice water, but it will grow with something else. But still, I feel like it's just an exaggerated thing. It's just one of those things in the natural hair community that once one person proves that it works, tons of other people start using it and whether or not it works for them, they just jump on it to create content for clout. And that is not a bad thing in my opinion, but still, it's good that people are experimenting, discovering that this is something that can be used on hair. I just feel that it's something that does not work magic in such a short period even though it grows hair really fast it'll be for the longer term like a month two months three months etc so that is just my opinion I'm going to go ahead and let you guys see what I did throughout the period I'm going to go ahead and carry you guys through the process of washing my hair 
and then afterwards I will show you guys how I sealed my hair I didn't do much at all and after everything I simply sealed my hair after I washed my hair I simply sealed it and I moisturized and that was that so this is me about to wash my hair this is how I left my hair after the first day so like I said I put it into chunky twist and then just matted it down in two huge sections and kept spraying the rice water over this section so my hair is really frizzy here it was even begin to knot but i had to quickly take it down and wash it and guys i am not exaggerating when i say this rice water stunk or stinked i don't know what the past tense of stink is but it was really smelly and i did not refrigerate it i did not do anything to preserve it i simply put it in my spray bottle and left it sitting for the length of time i used it for so it was really really smelly but i used it anyway i wanted to really allow the rice water to ferment to the highest capacity that it could ferment to and then see if there will be any difference when i reapplied it or when i kept applying it to my hair for the short term so here i'm simply applying some oil to my palms to take down my twist like i also mentioned guys i did not seal my hair with any oils at all so i didn't want to have my hair breaking unnecessarily which is why i applied oil to my palms so i simply applied some oil to my palms and then i proceeded to take down my sections now taking down the sections was pretty easy i didn't even finger detangle or anything i simply took them down and then proceeded to wash after separating each section a little bit more So I'm done separating my hair. I'm simply going to go ahead and proceed to wash. My hair was also a little bit sticky because of the continuous application of the water. Here I'm simply saturating my hair with water. Guys, as usual or as almost usual, our water is not strong enough for the shower to run. So I'm simply using a bowl to scoop my water and pour that onto my hair. So I'm simply saturating my hair with water trying to rinse all the rice water out first before I proceed to start shampooing my hair. One of the advantages of this rice water I observed was that it made detangling really easy. Like guys, this is me literally combing through my hair right after separating my sections. I didn't even apply conditioner. And like I said, I had only applied oil on the second day, which means from the time I started applying my rice water up until now, no bit of oil or anything that would aid detangling has touched my hair except the rice water and combing through was relatively easy so yeah there is that which is an advantage at the end of the day the breakage that i got wasn't much i wanted to show you guys how the breakage was so this is all the breakage i got after combing through my hair the first time and this is the amount of rice water that i had left next i'm going to go ahead and shampoo my hair thoroughly and i'm using my diy black soap shampoo i applied that directly to my hair and went ahead to massage my scalp thoroughly and to wash my hair thoroughly as well and for me at this point shampooing my hair was the most important part of wash day because i really wanted to get the smell of that water out of my hair i really wanted my hair squeaky clean and i also wanted my hair to be rid of any product buildup that i had had before i started applying the rice water So I'm done shampooing my hair. I shampooed twice to really get all the product build up out and this is what my hair is looking like at this time. I'm simply scraping my scalp with a single fingernail to see if there is any product left there. And then the next thing I did was to apply conditioner to my hair and proceed to detangle. I'm using this pomegranate bliss moisturizing conditioner from Alberto VO5 and this is actually a watered down version of this conditioner i added water to it because it's typically thick and i was running out i needed more so i just simply added water to increase the quantity so i did the entire thing involved in finger detangling hair 
using conditioner and this is all the breakage i had when i was done with that so that was how simple my wash day was next thing i did was to go ahead and seal my hair and this was really simple i didn't do much i simply sectioned my hair with my fingers and then i proceeded to apply my whipped shea butter to each section i was supposed to do this the next day but guys still this very day i haven't done anything and that was that so here i am the next day and this is the amount of breakage i got from the entire thing from detangling my hair right after the rice water to sealing my hair with the whipped shea butter and here i'm simply taking down these twists because i want to see how much growth i have had in the six days that i used the rice water i want to see how much magic was able to manifest from using the rice water so i simply took down my twists and proceeded to measure out my hair against the first time i started using rice water so this is was this was a weak attempt to comb through my hair i wasn't really serious and i didn't bring out my peak comb so i'm simply going to go right ahead and pull my hair out to see if there was any new length and I really couldn't tell but I could feel that there really wasn't any significant growth from using the rice water so this is where my hair stops now I think it's this about the same place it stopped before for the side of my face on my head and this is what my or this is where my hair stopped for the back which is the exact same place it stopped the first time i used rice water so guys i don't know what the magic your youtubers claim is but it didn't happen for me so that was simply that for this video there really wasn't much involved i simply went ahead to do something else to my hair and that was that and that's it for this video guys thank you so much for watching please do not forget to subscribe and to stay subscribed hit that bell button so you get all my video notifications also leave a comment in relation to this video in the section below and share this video with people whom you feel need to see it and please don't let anybody pressure you into believing that because rice water didn't work for your hair speedily there's something wrong there's nothing wrong the growth rate for hair for everyone is different and how fast one person's hair grows will be different from how fast your hair will grow even though you guys use the same thing so that's just my experience guys honestly so 